I'm Vim Vigorous. This is Successes for Losers. For those of you who missed yesterday's episode but are currently watching this one, let me bring you up to speed. I've been trying for 32 business days to convince my friend Finestone to be my entertainment lawyer. But despite my telling him repeatedly that he was about to participate in the most famous self-improvement project ever, ever, he would not be moved. Finally, it occurred to me that to change his mind, I actually had to show him some sign of self-improvement. So I resolved to clean my office, something I promised the world that I would do weeks ago. Well, naturally, I didn't get started on it last night because it was the end of the day already, and I was busy editing the video. When I woke up this morning, at the crack of 11, I was refreshed and ready to go. And here you see me easing in to the cleaning project. And I'm gathering up a little speed. I went out because I had to pee. More cleaning. A little more cleaning. Getting in the zone. A little light lunch. Just feeling a little sluggish after lunch. I kept going. All the time I was resisting their urge to nap. I was wrapping up, I felt a lot of esteem for myself. I guess that's what it was. So I put aside everything else to complete this task that I've been putting off forever. So I rewarded myself by checking my Facebook messages. And what did I discover? That morning while I was slaving away at my office cleaning project, the Finestone had sent something into my inbox. He said he was coming to town in a couple of weeks and he wanted to arrange with me to have a sit down. So he said he wanted to have a sit down. A sit down. So he even apologized for not being able to bring Jamie Farr and his agent. So it was really fantastic news. This is what I waited for for so long. You know, but I couldn't help but thinking if I'd only check my email several hours earlier I could have, that I could have avoided cleaning my office. Which is uh, just really one of the most annoying chores to do. And it's, that's why I kept putting it off because it was so annoying. So I began, began kind of to regret having spent the day in such misery still you know so i think i've learned something a sit down in the hand is worth two epiphanies in the other hand two to six epiphanies i'd say oh, yeah!